Hello, Sarah from the Bureau with your weekend forecast. Now we're expecting dry and settled conditions for the majority of Australia this weekend, which is great news for barbecue weather, but not such good news for farmers that are looking for rainfall. Apart from in the southeast, with cool and showery conditions as the cold front passes across the region. So getting straight into it, here's that cold front moving across the southeast enhancing shower activity and also dropping snow levels down to 600 metres, with snowfall also forecast about the alpine areas of New South Wales and Victoria as well, and a really brisk, strong westerly flow in its wake. Now away from the southeast, however, these really dry conditions that's being driven by this high pressure system here, extending a ridge across the country with clear skies across the majority, apart from low cloud that's expected to build in an onshore flow about the coast of the bite there, and even large areas of fog that might be quite late to lift in the morning. Now into Sunday, those clear skies continuing across the majority. However, showers starting to increase again during the afternoon across the southeast as this trough here approaches. And there's even the potential for a few showers to develop about southern parts of New South Wales during the latter part of the day and into the evening. Temperature wise, tomorrow is forecast to be a much cooler day across southern parts of Queensland and that's thanks to a southerly change that's pushed up the east coast. Mild in the southeast due to that cold front and out in the west heat really starting to build. We're forecasting a maximum of 32 degrees and sunny conditions for Perth. For Adelaide, a shower or two, a top of 20 degrees. Down in Melbourne, a shower or two, a maximum of 18. For Hobart, Windy, a maximum of 16. Over in Sydney, sunny conditions and 28, while up in Brisbane, sunny and a top of 30. But as we move into Sunday, really warming up through southern parts of New South Wales and northern New South Wales as well, remaining really cool to cold in uh, southeastern parts of the country and heat continuing to build out in the west with maximum temperatures expected to be between eight to 14 degrees above the October average. So if you are interested in a more detailed forecast for your neck of the woods, then you can visit the Bureau website or download the BOM app. Otherwise, have a great weekend and we'll see you again next time. Bye for now.